Nityanandam. In this video, I just came to share what Swamiji had shared in the recent satsangs. He was very particularly sharing about the modern education system and the modern physics. So when he was sharing that, he just said modern day physics should be called as limited physics. It is not the physics of the physics. So you know it is not the physics of the physics. It is just the physics of the perceived. Whatever you say, whatever you see, it is the physics of the perceived and not the physics of the physics. So physics, it does not accept any generation of energy and it only accepts conversion or transformation of energy. So a modern day physics, it doesn't accept what is the Brahma, what is the real source. But our real source, which is called as Brahma, is the only and the most best educational system we have. So actually, Brahmins should reject physics because of this one law, which says energy cannot be generated. Energy can only be interchanged. What is the physics principle we actually study? Energy can be generated, energy can be created, and energy can be destroyed. So just by this one law, this physics should be rejected. It is what Swamiji said. So it is a huge shift for all of us when one law of physics is actually made redundant. So chemistry of the perceived is not chemistry. And alchemistry, the alchemy, is the real chemistry. So what he said was a real amazing thing. He said, biology produced by the bodies of the dead. Like, we just, in colleges, in medical colleges, we dissect the dead bodies and we know what is biology, like what is heart, where is the heart, where is the brain, where is the intestine. And he says that cannot be biology. If you cannot scan a living body. For example, when a, when a patient comes, without any diagnostic procedures, if you cannot scan with your three eyes, like your third eye, if you cannot just scan the patient's body and give him a cure, you cannot be a biologist. So this is such a different transformation or it is such a shift in cognition about what is biology. So with this body scanning power which Swamiji initiates all his disciples into the third eye to scan the body of a living person is the most amazing invention or is the most amazing thing which any human being can have. And the moment you cut the rose from the plant, it is no more a rose. It is just the dead body of the rose. The same way, a human body, only when you can scan the human body physically when it is alive, then it is real biology. So this is a huge click. And with this click, I wanted to meet you all guys in the next video talking about this. Yeah, I know.